Hey guys, do you ever get confused about what you're supposed to know when you're dealing with your pregnant patients and when you're doing your fetal heart rates? Well, I've got a mnemonic for you today. It's called veal chop. Now let's take a look at what each of these letters means. Starting with V, V means variable. You're gonna have variable accelerations and that could also mean that there's cord compression happening. So what can you do for your patient? Well, the first thing you can do is reposition your patient or you can provide them supplemental oxygen and then continue to monitor. Now let's take a look at the next one, which is E. These are early decelerations. Now, if we go along with CHOP, this is gonna be H, head compression. That means that we could be getting to the point where birth is about to happen. So just continue to check the cervix of the patient and monitor them. Now let's go to the A. A stands for accelerations. This is a totally normal occurrence and that means that it's okay. Now let's take a look at L. L is late decelerations, and what that means is you could have some P, or placental insufficiency. What that means is there is some oxygen that's not getting to the fetus. And so what we have to do is we have to make that happen by means most of the time by going to the OR and delivering the baby by C-section. Now that's our mnemonic on veal chop, and that's how you take care of your pregnant patients and you pay attention to those fetal heart tones. Subscribe and click the little bell so you can be notified when our next nursing mnemonics video comes out. Click the little box below for your free cheat sheet. And did you know we have a free nursing mnemonics course? Click the link in the description below and you can take that course for free. Happy, Happy nursing. nursing.